Focus on my own mind for a while, then it doesn't matter. This love's all I remember. And if it's only for the night, then... Hello there, everyone. It's been a long time since I uploaded a vlog or a video in this channel. How are you guys? I hope you guys have been doing well. It has been a while. <laughs> I wanted to address that I have been having finals, which is why I'm not uploading. But I will be uploading more as soon as I'm... Basically, these past week, these next few weeks, I'm going to be uploading per week. And yeah, I hope to continue to keep up that pace. Let's hope, because sometimes, you know, it's just not easy to make a video every week. But yeah, here in the background, as you can see, I'm actually making um, terrarium, a small little terrarium, which is a workshop that I actually joined. And here are some of the materials that I'm showing you. Um, they also gave me chopsticks and spoon, which at first I thought I accidentally like that power bring back a food and then I accidentally put it inside the bag, but it was from them. And so they gave me also this glass tea candy, which is the base of the terrarium. And I paid a fee for it actually, so these are not free, but it wasn't crazy expensive. I've always wanted to try build a terrarium, so this was actually a really cool experience. So I just followed the instructions that the host was actually telling me to, and yeah, it was pretty fun. And this is how it turned out. I didn't show the whole process, but yep, I need to do a little bit more finding final touches. And the top like sterns, colorful sterns were actually free for us to do whatever, however we want to decorate it. But I just do it kind of like in a simple way. And put this little cow right over there. And then I just water it and the host tells us to actually water it per month at least once or twice I think if I'm not wrong and yeah I have built my own terrarium So this 
this was actually filmed in another day i don't remember exactly but i'm pretty sure it's also one of the week ends um these are just compilations of my weekends guys so like i don't exactly know what day it is so i can't really state the date but this is me trying to do my animation which is for one of my final projects so i'm using procreate to actually do my animation and as you can see down there you can see the per frame that i did and I per frame I actually grouped some layers so that I can change up the layers still so it's just like so many 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 layers on one file but yeah that is a trick instead of like drawing one per one which is like something you might you know accidentally do something wrong and then you can't change it up I encourage you to actually do like per groups in procreate that is i don't think flip a clip no actually you can too in flip a clip which is a free app for animation if you want to try it out and if you use procreate or you have procreate and you want to try animation then you can also use this trick down here which i learned like after like experimenting with this app um that you can actually freeze the frame or the frame duration which you don't have to redraw or reduplicate everything which i at first did <laughs> this was such a helpful tip so here i'm just doing some of the scenes um for my final animation which is my project again <laughs> so if you're wondering what i'm doing here i'm just drawing a hand that this scene is supposed to make it so that you know the hand will cover the bag but at first it will have these like popping sound effect of like the things just you know entering inside the bag but it's just like those simple cartoony effect you know and then this hand will actually cover the bag that is all for the scene but it took me quite a few frames even to just draw this few seconds of scene so yeah animation definitely requires patience like a lot of patience but it is very satisfying at the end i have to be honest <laughs> so yep as you can see i'm just like scrolling through around to see the timing and then playing it back and forth and then I'm actually going to add some of the sound effects on another platform. But yeah, that is all for it that I'm going to show about the animation in this video. So now I'm actually gonna do journaling. Um, I have this like group journal collab, but I haven't done it. So I have to do it, which I'm actually late. It's basically a collab journal that is hosted by another um, user, K-pop journal account user. I don't remember the name of the account, but I think it should be in my Instagram. So I'm just picking out pictures from Pinterest, and then I'm going to use Snow to actually, oh no, actually this is Line Camera, to actually edit the images to make it some kind of sync in kind of the colors and to make it soft but also aesthetic in a sense. So here the main theme of the journal is actually to do like little accessories that the K-pop idols use, like the ones that we like. And I really really love the accessories that Jenny of Blackpink uses. Like she uses these like lots of like, hair accessories on her hair and especially this one like an ice cream. This bow in her like two pigtails is just so freaking cute so I had to add it in. <laughs> And then I'm just changing it so that the color will kind of match with other images that I have for this journal page. And if you hear some background, that is because I'm watching like Among Us. <laughs> and here I'm taking Lisa as well. I really love her um, like clips on the hair. That is so freaking cute. That is so cute. And here I'm using Ayu for her nails and then Jenny on her hair again. And then Ayu for her hair and her earrings, so cute. And I love this soft blue that um, band that Jenny uses. And for this, I love the choker and just everything about it. It's just so pretty. 
and yep i'm just gonna crop it to just the accessories but you probably can tell it's jenny and stuff <laughs> And then now I'm just gonna compile them all so that in my A4 size page so that when I print it I can paste it you know and in a way that I can cut them as well so I'm just inserting them one by one over here like Lisa IU and all the edits that I've did and just resize them to the size that I probably want it to be in the A4 And here I'm just gonna go look for random images that I can actually put in the journal as well and even if I don't use it on the journal I might use it for next journals so I'm just taking eyes and just cute accessory stuff I'm gonna munch on my papaya a BTS run and a papaya and fruits is just the best to end the day with <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for waiting. I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Do like and subscribe. It will be greatly appreciated.